of the most profound surah of Quran, one of the smallest surahs, Surah Al-Asr, consisting of three ayat. And there are three surahs consisting of three ayat. No surah of two ayat. The least number is three. Surah Al-Asr, Surah Al-Qasr, Surah Al-Nasr. Three surahs. And this is the most profound, according to Imam Shafi Rahmatullah Adai. No tadabbar al nasu hadhi surah, la wasiyatum. If people ponder only over this surah, this will suffice to guide them. In another saying he says, La ulam yunazal min al Quran is siwaha la kafatin nas. If nothing was revealed to Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam except this surah, this surah would have been sufficient for the guidance of humanity. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Alas, by the fleeting time, the time which is running, 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 it's going, and this is only capital you have. And like ice, it is melting. If you don't sell your ice, it will melt away. So by this time, what is that psalm of life, that poem? Art is long and time is fleeting, and our hearts, though stout and brave, still like muffled drums are beating, funeral marches to the grave. With every beating of the heart, we are coming closer and closer, step by step, to our graves. Just like if the dead body of a general is taken to the grave, you know, there is the beating of the drum. With each beating of the drum, this funeral is progressing. So, Rafil tujhe ghadi aliye deta hai manadi, gardu ne ghadi ur ki ek aur ghata di. When the clock rings, eleven, one more hour has been diminished from your life. One more hour, gone. Don't say that your life is increasing. Every hour your life is decreasing. Also, All mankind is doomed. To be doomed is the general rule. To be saved is an exception. All mankind. That is why Imam Radhi says, Elam. أَنَّ هَذِهِ الْآيَةِ فِيهَا وَعِيدٌ شَدِيدٌ لِأَنَّ اللَّهَ تَعَالَى حَكَمَ بِالْخِسَارِ عَلَى جَمِعِ النَّاسِ إِلَّا مَنْ كَانَ آتِيًا بِهَذِهِ الْأَشْيَاءِ الْأَرْبَعَةِ وَهِيَ الْإِمَانِ وَالْعَمَلُ الصَّالِحِ وَالتَّوَاسِبِ الْحَقِّ وَالتَّوَاسِبِ الصَّبْرِ أَنْ دَلَّ ذَلِكَ أَنَّ النَّجَاةَ مُعَلَّقَةٌ بِمَجْمُوعِ هَذِهِ الْأَشْيَاءِ There is a very big threat in this surah. Because Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has decided that all human beings will be doomed, thrown into the hell, except those who fulfill four conditions. And this is decisive to say that the salvation on the day of judgment depends upon fulfilling the four, all the four conditions. Now when I started my work, this verse of Surah Al-Asr was the starting point. And the selected course of study that I have edited, the starting point is Surah Al-Asr. I have written also, so I can't go into detail at this time. All men, all human beings are doomed except illa lazid amanu, except those who have faith, real faith, conviction, iman. Wa'amil salihat, and they did good deeds. And Tawaswa bil Haq, they exhorted each other to whatever is correct and just. Tawaswa bil Sabr, and exhorted each other to perseverance and steadfastness. May Allah give us the courage to fulfill all these four prerequisites of salvation.